How's it going boys? Welcome everybody back to another video. So today we'll be looking at the new Lucas and Andy's Path to Glory. It's another one that is in squad battles or obviously division rivals. Similar to Christian Eriksen, we're going to go over uh, all of these objectives of then going to obviously build a team. And now I have had lots of people obviously saying why are you building a team? Why is the team so bad? The squad builder is simply for the people that are watching us that are more of a casual community, the people that do not have much players in your club. But obviously when it does come to squad battle objectives, there's not much requirements. You can use your players but we will obviously still go ahead and build a, a cheap little squad builder that costs between 20 and 30k to help out um, obviously the more casual community also as well boys if you are new to the channel make sure to drop a like and subscribe we upload play reviews pack openings basically whenever EA drops something we try our best to release it without further ado boys let's get into it first of all score four headers in squad battles on at least professional difficulty or obviously rivals I would definitely recommend doing these in squad battles so it will take 12 separate squad battle matches um, it's, current, it's, it's around 15 min minutes a match, right? So 15 minutes, 6 minutes a half. Technically, it's 12, but that doesn't count in the half time. That doesn't count, you know, in between games. So it's literally 15 times 12 is um, 180 minutes divided by 60. Uh, boom, three hours on the dot. So basically, this objective, if you do it in squad battles, and you do obviously do all of it correctly, it will take three hours on the dot. So it's a three hour grind, and my first tip of them all, it's not really an actual tip, but just chuck a Netflix film on, play professional, keep playing the bad teams, and get this done easily. But the score four headers doesn't have to be in separate matches, so you could get the score four headers done in one match, and that's why you will probably want a more taller striker up front. It's just with crosses in three separate matches, once again, if you do assist with a cross, to, to someone's head, you're getting both of them done at the same time. Score using French players and assist in 12 separate uh, matches, uh, no, yeah, professional difficulty or rivals using defense. I almost uh, messed up there, but defenders assist will be annoying. Um, basically, I'll give you guys my number one tip for this. I've had lots of people asking about defender assist and how to do them. I have got the perfect tip for you. Without further ado, boys, let's hop over to the squad builder. For the squad builder, lads, it is literally so simple. So, so, so simple. Literally, all you need is French players. So, first of all, search your club for French players. Search, like, like I could use my team of, or my, my team of season, my Red Mbappe, my Vera. I could use my Dembele. I can use any French players in your club. So, search just for a French player because you obviously just need to get the French goals or something like that. But we are going to build a squad builder, like I said, for those of you that maybe do not have a team and have like 30,000 coins to get this done. So like I said, if you guys are watching this and you're not a casual player, then you will have no worries with the, with the squad builder. Boy, so this is a squad builder. We've just gone for a full, simple French squad because why not? You need that French goal or French assist, something like that. And I mean, a full French team, why not? It's a very budget team, like I said, for those of you that do not have players in your club. Working from left to right, we've got Dembele on the left. Hauler up front, just because he's six foot three and he's got 86 heading accuracy, you want to be getting those headers. Right wing is, I'm not going to try to pronounce that name, Falvin maybe? Okay, hopefully that's right. We've got Cock in the midfield, in Dombale, Alwa, we've then got Figo Hernandez, we've got Kunde, Upamecano, Mukulele, and My Nan. I, mean, I don't even know if it's My Nan, it's just a meme on my Twitch channel, we should call him My Nan. Um, but we've got My Nan in there, a full French team, and like I said, it doesn't have to be a full French team, but I mean, you may as well, you need a French player, so you may as well build a team around them. Now, four of the fullbacks are assisting with the fullbacks, assisting with the defenders, as I said in the intro, what you want to do is go into the game with this team, and then as soon as you're in the game, chuck a pause and move your left backs and move your right backs up to the wingers that way you can obviously assist with them from the wing it can be from center mid cdm but as long as your defender is in a defender position to start with like your kunde like as long as you go into the game with mukulele and theo hernandez at right and left back you can move him up to left and right wing in game and it will count as defender assist because obviously assisting from the wing is a lot easier than assisting from the full backs um now as for the headers literally four headers with uh, hauler six foot three really good heading accuracy i mean it's just as easy as that really lads it's a very very easy objective now the second tip is going to be the bench you can have any bench in the game uh, so if you do build this team just put the best players you possibly can on your bench all of the players you have in your club just chuck them on the bench you guys give a point and the third tip if you are struggling Maybe you don't play too much. Maybe you're not a great player. Um, if you are struggling, simply, I do recommend buying. This is not sponsored, by the way. I wish I was sponsored. Um, but this is basically Footbin. It is a free app to buy. Let's take Dembele's normal card for an example. Uh, you can basically look at the card, look how much they are on the, on the transfer market, and you can just muck, muck, muck around, muck around with chem styles. So the second tip is going to be chemistry styles. Dembele, you can see, is an 83-rated left wing. But if you were to go on Footbin and chuck, let's say, a marksman, 
Wiseman on him, he goes to 85 shooting, uh, he goes to 85 finishing, 86 long shots, he gets some ball control and dribbling boost, and he now goes to in-game an 87 rated left wing and an 86 rated center forward. So basically, all you want to do, chemistry styles, even if it's not for correct chem style, if you've got any chem style on you, chuck it on them and it will make them significantly better in a game. Now the third and final and the most important tip, it's only on professional difficulty, I think maybe some of them is on world class, we'll just obviously have a double check at this now, um, is someone world class? Yeah, so some is on world class, so you have to play it on world class. But yeah, score using French players in eight separate matches. But just recapping over these, score for headers, you've got Hauler for that. Assist with crosses, you can do with your full backs from right or left wing. Score using French players, your whole team is French. And assist in 12 separate matches with defenders is obviously why you're going to want to move your full backs up to the wingers in game. But the third and most important tip... To learn, if you don't know how to be world class difficulty, you've got unlimited attempts. Obviously with squad battles, if you guys don't know, after you play four games or after you play at least one game, you can refresh it. As you can see there, we're doing some objectives, 35-0. Um, basically, as soon as you play a game, you see uh, square or X, and you can update your opponents. Um, obviously, I've now exceeded the 40 match limit, which doesn't mean anything. Uh, these will still count towards my objectives. All it means is that my points towards my rank will stop counting. But as you can see, you can keep refreshing, and we've got a 64 rated squad. Make sure make sure you do play it on at least world class difficulty. 68 rated squad as well. Now these 91 rated squads and these big boys, you want to avoid them because playing them on world class will be relatively challenging, but you should have no problem at all. I usually beat these like 20 nil on world class because they're playing, they're playing Jay Rodriguez, a striker, on free chemistry in net. So <laughs> you should be fine if you do play these on world class, just try avoid the high ratings. But as soon as you play one, you can once again, you can you have the option to refresh, keep refreshing it, keep playing those poor teams on world class, and obviously keep ranking up. Uh, we'll keep getting these objectives done. Now boys, I actually do want to add something else to these objective guys, because usually we just go over the objectives, usually I'll end the video here. I actually want to see what his stats are in game, because that's something I'm actually interested about. So I believe it's Lucas, Hernandez and fingers boys as well. He can get some upgrades, which is the huge thing about this card. And he plays for France. France are currently one and zero in the group stage, so I could see him getting some upgrades soon. So he's a centre back, high high. First of all, I do not like high high as a centre back. He's left footed. Um, his pace isn't great, but obviously the potential of upgrading. His reactions is phenomenal. Defending physical. He looks like a really solid centre back. Nothing special, but I feel like if he can get the three wins, so France need two more wins, he'll go to a 92 rated. Feel like a 92 rated, should have 86 or 87 pace in. Be very, very nice. And a power hitter, looks like a solid card. And, and the fact that he can upgrade is a big bonus. Lads, if you guys have, have any tips for anyone else, leave them down below. But also, if you've got any questions, leave them down below. And I'll try to respond to you within the next 24 hours or so. It's been your boy Davis. If you did get anything from this review, make sure to drop a like and sub. Sorry, it's not a review, but objectives, guys. Sorry. Make sure to drop a like and sub. Until next time, see you later, boys.